I'm Jamie Stein. I'm the coordinator of the Environmental Systems Management Program at Pratt Institute. One of the very unique things about the Environmental Systems Management Program here at Pratt Institute is that we're creating really an interdisciplinary or a systems thinking professional. Because we are so diverse within our curriculum and because we offer such a wide network, the student can then really work within that to create a very specific and detailed master's degree. Uh, so every class that I took over the last two years um, had something that I was able to bring to work and eventually bring it to a specific project, uh, to a specific meeting, to a specific advocacy uh, convention, or somehow has migrated into a piece of policy that has been implemented uh, in some of the countries where I have worked. One of the things that is really great about the program is having real professionals in the classroom um, who are, you know, we, we go nine to five through our work day and then we're here applying that, you know, applying the things we learned during, uh, during the evening to our work during the day. I think that the Pratt student body is unique because they really represent a wide range of professions, um, both in terms of their, what the interests that they're coming to the table with and the backgrounds that they already have. And because sustainability is such an integrated systems-based analysis or sort of systems-based study, when you're looking at it through multiple lenses, it really helps to understand the effects and the causes behind those different issues. The diversity of the student body really enriches the academic experience here at Pratt uh, from a variety of perspectives. First, the different disciplines that our students come from uh, gives you a interdisciplinary or transdisciplinary way at looking at various different issues. So you don't look at it from purely your own set of givens, but you begin to understand how a particular issue or a particular problem or a particular opportunity uh, can be worked to benefit uh, the society as a whole. Uh, Pratt, both by its location, uh, because of its student body, uh, is really, I think, poised to address some of the hard issues uh, that confront uh, uh, our de decision makers and planners and environmentalists. The type of cutting edge professionals that we have coming into the classroom in the evenings, giving you their undivided attention, teaching you the skills that they have in the industry, and then allowing you access to their networks is really the heart of the program. Not only are we learning these cutting edge techniques within environmental policy, within environmental design, and within community-based development and organizing, we're really learning uh, and, and growing our own professional network. I'm currently interning in the Newark City Office of Sustainability. Um, the director of which is Chelsea Albuquer, who is a Pratt professor. This was kind of a perfect opportunity for me because I'm interested in policy and this covers a whole broad variety of sustainability initiatives that are being worked on in Newark. This program can really introduce you to all of the sustainability issues specific to New York City. It can be applied to other urban areas, but it's very urban and it's very New York based. Uh, one of the things that I most appreciated about the professors was that they're really involved in a lot of the current initiatives that are going on in New York City, such as the Green Codes Task Force and uh, active in their professions in uh, design and construction and, and policy. And um, just the fact that you're getting real experiences as opposed to just a purely academic um, experience. Things I liked most about Signe Nielsen's landscape class um, was that she really encouraged us to understand what the current building codes and design codes are and how we would want to envision that differently if we were going to actually be active professionals. So it really helped you understand what is realistic in terms of designing right now in New York and what we need to change in order to help New York move forward. There's more opportunities now uh, in the, the environmental field than there were before because all of our laws have to change, our policies have to change to meet the change in times. We all have to do a paradigm shift to be effective in the new uh, society because it, there's only going to be a certain amount of time 
where we're greening things. And then after 25, 30 years, they'll be greened. The students have to be part of that practice now. As we move forward in our Climate Challenge future, it is imperative that we create interdisciplinary thinkers, real systems-based professionals that can address all three pillars of sustainability, the, the economics, the environment, the social equity. And these are the type of professionals that can move us forward in our climate challenge future.